welcome or welcome back to my channel this is Nalish for children and today's video is going to be really interesting and different as well because today in this video we are going to try some viral instagram reel recipes and it's going to be a hostel edition because obviously i live in a hostel and i don't have a lot of equipments and ingredients to try like you know very complicated delicious recipes so this video is going to be all about trying like very easy recipes and which can be made in 10 to 15 minutes and yeah if you live alone or if you have some friends who live in hostel then you should share this video with them this video is going to be very useful for them and uh, okay so a little disclaimer so the first two recipes will have uh, eggs included in it so if you are someone who is purely vegetarian and uh, do not eat eggs then you should skip to this point of time because we have some veg recipes as well so yeah that's about it let's just get started with today's video first recipe is egg bread so this is how they made it in the video so for this recipe the ingredients you are gonna need are an egg some slices of bread some onions some salt for the taste some red chili powder and vegetable oil don't judge me I have my vegetable oil in a sprite bottle Okay, so first we are going to take some onions and finely chop them. Then take a bowl or a container like this and break a egg in it. Then in that we are going to add some red chilli powder. Some salt. And then we are going to add the chopped onion in it. Then mix this whole thing and uh, our batter is ready. So now I have uh, only an induction here so I am going to cook on this. Take a pan or kadhai whatever you have add some oil in it and toast your breads. If you have a uh, you know bread toaster then you should toast your breads in that but here I am doing on a pan. So yeah, after toasting the bread, I'm gonna again put the bread in the pan and add the batter which we prepared before onto the bread, on one side of the bread, like so. And then I'm gonna flip this and I'm gonna let the other part cook and then again I'm gonna add the batter to the other side as well. Once uh, both the sides are cooked properly, then you should take out the bread from the pan and I did the same thing with the other bread as well. So this is how it finally looks and I think it looks really delicious. So I'm gonna try this with you guys. I haven't really ate this before so yeah, let's just try it. really really good I really like this you should definitely try this if you like eggs now you're gonna love this trust me okay so the next recipe is a like an anda bhuji so uh, yeah this is how it looks and uh, to make this recipe you are gonna need two eggs some onion some salt red chili powder vegetable oil and some slices of bread so first I'm going to start off uh, with boiling one egg. Once the egg is boiled, uh, peel it off and chop the egg into small pieces like this. Again take a pan, add some vegetable oil in it. Then we are going to add some chopped onions into the oil and let the onion cook until it gets you know like a brownish color then add some red chili powder mix it well then add some salt and now we are going to add the chopped egg into this and we are going to let this cook for at least two to three minutes now add a raw egg into this and quickly mix it up with the other mixture and yeah we are going to again let this cook for a while and it's done 
this is how the final dish looks like. Okay, so let's try this one as well. Also does good. Uh, let me finish this before. <laughs> okay, so this one also tastes good, but there is nothing different. It just um, tastes like you know normal anda burji. And yeah, that's about it. But it's it's nice. It tastes nice. Okay, so let's just move on to the next recipe. Uh, the next recipe is called. Uh, a tomato chutney basically this video is getting so viral on Instagram and I had to try this for this video so yeah to make this a uh, tomato chutney you're gonna need some tomatoes some garlic some onion and again some salt red chili powder and vegetable oil Cut the tomatoes into half like this. Do not finely chop them. Now take a pan, add some vegetable oil in it and place the tomatoes in the oil like so. Let the tomatoes cook for a while. You can also place a lid onto the pan so that it helps with cooking faster. Now you are supposed to wait for a while and uh, cook the tomatoes from both the sides as well and uh, wait until you get a texture like this now take the tomatoes off the pan add some oil and add some chopped garlic into the oil and uh, some red chili powder let the garlic cook for a while now keep this tadka aside and we are going to start with the tomatoes first you have to peel off the covering of the tomatoes like so Then take a container or a bowl, add the tomatoes into this and you are going to take a spoon and quickly smash the tomatoes like so. This is how it should look. Now we are going to add the tadka we prepared before into this mixture. Uh, don't judge my tadka, it's gotten a little bit da <laughs> darker, thoda jal gaya hai, but yeah, you, you do a better job. Then again, add some uh, chopped onion into it and some salt. Also some red chilli powder because we like everything spicy. Mix it uh, all together and yeah, your tomato chutney is all ready. This is how it looks and I think it looks really delicious. Let's just try it out. Okay, I'm really excited to try this tomato chutney and yeah, let's just dig in. Okay, it looks really delicious. I'm trying it with bread. You can also try this with normal chapati. But I don't have a chapati right now. That's why I'm trying it with bread. So yeah. Surprisingly, this also tastes good. I mean, it tastes really good, guys. You should definitely try this one. It's just that I have added a lot of onion in it. You should add a little bit less onion, I feel. But if you are someone who likes a lot of onion, like, you know, kacha onion in their uh, food, then yeah, this is also nice. Okay, so let's just move on to the next recipe. The next, uh, it's, it's not a food recipe, it's just like, you know, a little snack kind of a thing that you can do when you're watching some movie or something like that. So yeah, to make this one, you're gonna need different kind of chips, some onion. First, we are going to chop the onion into small pieces like so. Now you're gonna need a tomato, again chop the tomato into fine pieces as well. Mix the uh, onion and tomato well, then add some mayonnaise over it. And you can also add some chaat masala if you have any. And uh, yeah, then quickly add the chips to the plate and enjoy your 
really delicious snack dish. I ate this with my friends and they also loved it. You should definitely try this one while watching a movie or you know just chilling around. Okay, so that's it for this video you guys. I hope this video was helpful uh, and you enjoyed watching this video. And if you try any of these recipes then don't forget to tag me on Instagram with the pictures. Please share this video with your hostel friends and some friends who live alone and <laughs> who might try these recipes. So yeah, that's about it. I will see you guys in my next video. Till then, bye bye, take care.